Good morning, people of social media. How are you guys doing today? It is Pyre Daniel here. Um, it is 10.45 and I just got done with some breakfast. I got a Belgian waffle at the Broken Egg, Broken Yolk, something like that, uh, here in Palm Springs, California. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. Oh, hey, I didn't see that. Just got to the gym, like I said before, I'm working triceps and biceps, so let's hit it. Just got done with the gym. Um, I did a little uh, physique update right here. And a uh, little bit of a rant right here. So I saw this guy who was working legs. He had a knee brace on. And he started with like two plates. And I was like, okay, well, he's doing what he's doing. And then he just continued to put weights and weights and weights on. And he was doing like 10 plates on this leg press machine. And it makes no sense to do that when you have an injury, when you are recovering, you don't need to push yourself into the max limits that you're capable of. I mean, right now, I, I don't need to go above 65 pounds with barbell curls. No point for me to go to 135. Can I do 135 barbell, barbell curls? Yes, but am I going to? No, because what is that going to accomplish? My rep range is between 10 to 15 reps. I try to get 15 reps on like everything I do and that's how I'm gaining my size and that's how I'm gaining the leanness that I'm getting in my muscles. It's, it's, I'm not doing four sets of three reps for every exercise. I'm doing four sets of 15 reps for every exercise. That's how you gain the muscle. That's how you gain the size and, and the dense muscle. I mean, if you wanna be a power lifter, go ahead, go do that weight. But when you have a knee brace on and you're trying to power lift, I don't see the point in that because you're already in recovery, you're already broken down. I mean, fully recover and then get back into it. Otherwise, you're just kind of wasting your potential and just waiting, waiting to get injured again. And that's not the point of lifting and that's why bodybuilding and, and lifting gets a bad name and why it's so, hard on your muscles because people are stupid and just push their bodies to the absolute limit when they can't be pushed. What are you trying to prove with a knee brace on and 10 plates? That you can break your leg again? You can injure yourself? Doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, but I mean, if you are healthy and you wanna see how much you can bench press, you wanna see how much you can squat, Go ahead, that is your personal choice, but you know what? 
I, I don't need to max to see how much I can lift. If I'm lifting 225 for 12 reps on bench press, I'm a-okay with that. You know, I may go up to 275 and do like six reps, but I mean, that's that's just because I want to look big in the gym, you know? I, I, there's no point. If you are a power lifter and you want to push that heavy weight, go do those 10 plates. But if you're just the average gym goer, which this guy seemed like it, there is no need to do 10 plates on each side for leg press. There's absolutely no reason for it. If you're just trying to get in shape, you're on a healthy diet, and, and I mean, you go to the gym, exercise, you know? That's it. People today. Sorry about that, guys. Rant over. Now I'm going to take a shower and see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoy it and uh, keep living life, and I will see you next time.